ITV is live in Australia for the down after 17 minutes. But that was the only real problem the Kent team had. Four minutes into the second half, they were level. Captain Andy Hessenthaler was naturally delighted to hit the equaliser against his former club. Gillingham were then awarded a penalty for a handball that stopped Adi Akinbaye's shot. If he and scored from the kick. And Gillingham added a third through Steve Butler, another former Watford player. Despite registering their fourth win on the trot, Gillingham stay 15th.